In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to play PS2 games on your iOS device without jailbreak or computer. So what you guys are going to do first is go into Safari. And in Safari, you're just going to search up Play Emulator GitHub and this will be to get the actual IPA. And from here, you guys have two options. Either you click on the GitHub and then find the website link there or it should show up just below the GitHub, right over here, it'll say play here. So just click on play, download. And then once that has loaded, what we have to do is instead of clicking on the stable builds, since it'll install a zip file instead of the IPA file, we're gonna go under automated builds and then we're just gonna click on iOS. Click install. And now once it has installed, all we need to do is just sideload this file, which I will do with Troll Store. So what you guys are gonna do is just search up Troll Store. And then in Troll Store, you're just going to click on this plus icon here. Click install IPA file. Click on the IPA file here. And then you'll see this pop up here. So just click install. And then as you guys can see, it has installed. So now what we have to do is open up play. So just click on it here. Click on open. And the reason why we have to open it is so that it creates all the necessary files and folders in your files app. So now what we're going to do is open up our files app. You're going to head over to on my iPhones. Now, all we need is the game in ISO format, which I do have downloaded here. So I'm just going to go into downloads. And then as you guys can see, I have the Spider-Man game. And you guys can see here that it is in fact 7Z, which means that unlike a normal zip file, where if you just click on a zip file here, it'll automatically make a folder for a 7z you will need a specific app so to extract this file all you guys need to do is just download any zip extractor on the app store so the one that i've installed is just called zip extractor and so what we need to do is go back into files and then where the zip file is you're just gonna hold on it click on share and then click on zip extractor here and then you might get an ad, so just click continue to app, click extract. And then I would say give it like two to three minutes. And it won't exactly tell you that it's extracted, but you're just going to have to keep checking back. So just wait two to three minutes and see if it does in fact load. And once you waited two to three minutes, what you guys are going to do is just simply go back to on my iPhone and then click on the actual zip extractor file here and uh, you should see the spider-man folder here so click on that click again over here and then you'll see the iso file and now what we have to do is long press on this iso file click on move and now you're just gonna go back to on my iphone so just go back click on play and then click move now all we need to do is just go back into the play app you're gonna click on settings Click rescan device for games over here. And then you guys will see your game. So now if I just click on the game here, it'll give you a pop up saying that JIT is unavailable. So if I do click continue, it will in fact crash like it just won't load. So what we have to do is go back into troll store. And then in Troll Store, where you've sideloaded it, click on the actual Play app and then click Open with JIT. So now if I click on the game, it'll still say the same pop-up. But if I click Continue, you can see that the game has in fact loaded. So in order to enable JIT, you must install with Troll Store. And then obviously your game will in fact load and everything will work perfectly fine. If you guys want to know how to enable JIT, without the use of troll store because troll store only goes up to ios 17 i will make a video on that shortly anyways i hope this video helped if it did please leave a like and subscribe thanks for watching